Desktop Server is the first step in creating an efficient WordPress workflow. It allows you to quickly and easily create a WordPress development environment on your own computer without the need for a publicly accessible hosting provider, making it a secure and safe way to build, break, and test your website before it's ready to be viewed by the world. Once you've created your site, Desktop Server Premium Service allows you the ability to easily deploy your site to the web host of your choice. This unique ability makes it the only tool of its kind in the WordPress space. To get started, first open up Desktop Server. On Windows, navigate to C colon backslash Lite and double click on the desktopserver.exe file. On Mac, Navigate to Applications, then XAMPP, and click on the Desktop Server S icon. Once Desktop Server opens, you'll see the Enable Developer Plugins screen. These design time plugins add additional functionality in your local site that work with Desktop Server to make your site development more efficient, but are not included when you deploy your site to a live host. ESCLI is a must-use plugin and cannot be deactivated. While all of these tools are useful, we highly recommend that you also activate the local SSL plugin. Once you've selected the plugins you would like to have active, click Next. Desktop Server will now enable your web and database services necessary to create a site on your computer. Once services start, you are presented with three options. To build a new WordPress site, select the Create a New Development Website radio button and click Next. Now, create a site name for your new site. All sites will default to a .dev.cc top-level extension. Now that you've created your site name, choose a blueprint. Blueprints are powerful time savers because you can create a template in which your standard plugins and themes are automatically added to your new WordPress site. Desktop Server comes standard with a version of WordPress as well as a dynamic blueprint which automatically downloads the latest versions of WordPress for your new site. Please note that an internet connection is required in order for any dynamic blueprints to function properly. Optionally, you can choose your site route or site location. By default, Desktop Server creates your sites in a folder named Sites on your computer. However, you can change the location on your website by clicking the Browse button and navigating to the directory of your choice. Please note that on some Mac systems, there are certain security protected directories which will not work. You can now click the Create button and let Desktop Server work its magic. Once complete, you can now click Next. To visit your newly created site, you can click on the site name or, from the main menu, you can click on the Sites button. When you click on the Sites button, a browser window will open up with useful links to your site. It's got WordPress dashboard, its database, or its command line interface. You can learn more about the Desktop Server Sites page by watching the video referenced in the description below. In the event that you've used a dynamic blueprint, we recommend that you log into the WordPress dashboard and add a new administrative user, then deleting the test admin administrator. To do this, log into your dashboard, select users, then add user. Create a username and enter the email address, then create a password and set the role to administrator. Once you have created the new user, log out of WordPress and then re-log in as the newly created user. Select users and then delete the test admin account. Optionally, you can delete all content associated with the test admin account or attribute the content to another user. Congratulations again on your choice to download and install Desktop Server. At ServerPress, our mission is to help you create a better quality of life by providing you with the services you need to design and develop WordPress sites as efficiently as possible. We look forward to serving you in any way that we can to achieve that goal.